China has received official confirmation that its geologists have discovered a new type of ore in the world's largest rare earth deposit. This ore, called niobobautite, contains niobium, a valuable metal known for its strength in the steel industry, and its superconducting properties. The discovery was made at the Bayan Obo or deposit in Bautu, Inner Mongolia. Niobobautite is a brown black ore composed of niobium, barium, titanium, iron, and chloride. Niobium is primarily used in the steel industry, where it enhances the strength of steel while reducing its weight. It is also used in the production of construction materials, boil and gas pipelines, propeller blades, and jet engines. Additionally, niobium is a superconductor at low temperatures, making it valuable in the production of superconducting magnets for particle accelerators and MRI machines. Geologists from a subsidiary of the China National Nuclear Corporation discovered this new mineral, marking the 17th new mineral found in Bautu and the 150th mineral found in the area overall. This discovery is significant for China since it currently heavily relies on imported niobium for its steel industry. Brazil currently dominates global niobium production, accounting for approximately 89% of the output. However, China's discovery could potentially make the country self-sufficient in niobium, depending on the volume and quality of the ore. The Brazilian Metallurgy and Mining Company, CBMM, which owns the majority of the world's niobium reserves, has been exploring niobium technologies for lithium batteries. They have partnered with battery manufacturers, universities, and research and development centers in China to advance this technology. Niobium-based batteries show promise in terms of longevity, as they can last up to 30 years, compared to traditional lithium-ion batteries. They also offer improved conductivity, faster charging times, approximately 10 minutes, and enhanced safety due to the absence of flammable liquid electrolytes. Overall, this discovery and the potential for domestic niobium production could have significant implications for China's steel industry and advancements in battery technology.